but I really want to show you what I typically eat in a day. What I 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 eat in a day. Hey guys, it's Madeline. Hello. It is very pink in here. I just woke up and did my skincare routine. That's why there is yet another pimple dot on my chin that you can kind of not see because I picked one that was skin colored. Did not plan for it to be raining outside when I shot this video. Yay. We're gonna talk about what I eat in a day. It's like something that I'm very nervous about doing because at the end of the day, it's like this is just truly what works for me. I do go through phases of what I like to eat. This is just like what I'm eating right now. I have a plant-based diet. I've been plant-based my whole life. Enough disclaimers, let's get to the video, little lady. Most importantly, I like to start my day, like every other YouTuber on the planet, a huge glass of water. All I want to do is get back in bed and make pancakes, but I really want to show you what I typically eat in a day. I think it's time to do it because I have no other idea. I don't remember what I was going to say. Bitch, go make some coffee. How do I become a morning person? Bonk. Let's make some coffee. Well, I just did a little bit of work on my computer and drank my coffee. We're going to make breakfast and I have therapy after this, which I'm very excited for. Hopefully it doesn't inspire me. Bonk. And then I'm gonna go to the gym and head to work. I definitely have to make like an active effort to eat healthy fats because I don't really incorporate it well into my diet. And I'm not in the mood for avocado toast this morning, although I do love to eat that sometimes. So I'm gonna have a spoonful of coconut oil with my breakfast. It's kind of disgusting. But it's what my nutritionist told me to do. Mmm, delicious. You will need some instant oatmeal. This one has no added sugar. A baniner, frozen blueberries, more almond milk. I truly just love oatmeal so much. I think it's so delicious. Anyway, you've all made oatmeal before. Oh, I wasn't gonna microwave it today. Okay, well I usually cook it on the stove, but it's already. When I eat cereal, I like my milk to just coat the cereal, and I feel the same way about my oatmeal. And then I just pour some frozen blueberries in there and put it in the microwave for a minute now. I am lazy, so I cut it in the peel. So yummy. I got a little excited, but it's really hot. Sometimes I start my day with celery juice. I did that a lot in LA, and I just haven't gotten into it here yet. I'm sure I'll do an update of what I eat in a day once I've really gotten into my routine here. I've only been here for like a month. I just enjoy kind of the ritualistic aspect of it. I'm actually going to make my salad for later, right now. Any kind of breaded chicken burger. You can also go without the breading pan. So to start off, I'm obsessed with Lucinato kale. It is my favorite kind of kale. Bonk. It's also referred to as dinosaur kale. Brand new, fresh kale. It's super crispy. Bonk. One bunch of Lucinato kale, another boxed green like a baby kale or spinach or something like that, and some balsamic vinegar. Break up. Yeah, I need to stop. I always wash my vegetables before they go in my refrigerator, so it makes it easier for me to grab and go. I'm now gonna get my little container. This came with the house, I don't usually get plastic. Break all of this up into tiny, tiny little pieces. three-fourths of this full, and then I'm just gonna grab about a handful of this. Drizzle it, and the chicken burgers, the plant-based burgers are actually done. Look at that. This looks absolutely disgusting. First thing in the morning. I will enjoy it later. So we're just gonna cut these up. I've always been excited about salads because I'm a psychopath. I'm gonna bring that with me to work later, and now for the worst part of the day. Bottoms up. Editing this made me realize it's 7.30 and I haven't had my coconut oil yet. It's actually delicious, it's just that texture is disgusting. I'll see you when lunchtime happens. One outfit change and workout later. Hello again. It's been a day and it's like 11.30 a.m. I had therapy this morning. I had a bit of an emotional morning, but that's okay. I went to the gym. 
I do typically order my smoothie every day. I know it's lazy. But I ended up with two for some reason today. I don't know why. So I have my usual, which is blueberry thrill with clean vegan protein. The blueberry thrill is just blueberries. I do no date, almond butter, some kind of protein. I choose clean vegan protein and almond milk, I think. Bonk. I don't believe in calorie counting. If anything, look at calories to make sure I'm getting enough. Listening to your body is so important. I try not to be too hard on myself. It's been a day. Thank you. You just make my world so much better. Wow, look at this great little spot I found. This is fantastic. So I think I'm gonna need another bevy for the row. There's a moment in time where I wish I could just ask the universe, do I want a hot coffee or a cold coffee? Bonk. If I have my way, I wouldn't drink Starbucks. There are drive throughs in Vancouver and that makes my life so much easier. I don't know, I guess. You guys will see what I got. Hi, is it possible for me to just get a 16 ounce cold brew, please? Okay, it's much later. We're gonna ignore this giant pimple dot on my chin. I'm about to eat my salad, so I figured we'd hang out for a second. It smells delicious. Come in. I look crazy right now. This is literally just what I needed. I have like 15 minutes to eat this before I have to go to set. I didn't plan on making this a what I eat in a day on set. I was gonna shoot this yesterday, but then I had a bit of an emotional breakdown. I only have one scene today. If I was at work all day, I would eat different stuff. Delicious. I wouldn't say I'm gonna have this home screen for the rest of my life, but look at how pretty it is. Well, while we're here, I did also bring myself a little booch. I love kombucha. I probably drink about one a day. Not every day, but I do like drinking it a lot. Kombucha is healthy soda. I'll see you when I eat again. Hello, I'm home. Time for me to make a very quick dinner. It's way too late. I'm gonna make a very classic modeling dinner. It's not anything that crazy. Do you want some cuddles? Come here. I love you. I love you so much. Come here. Okay. I love this dinner so much. It's so tasty. It's fairly healthy. It makes me feel like I'm eating a treat. It's basically like my version of vegan mac and cheese with protein pasta. Really? I like protein pasta because it just makes me feel better about my pasta addiction. This is the Modern Table Spirals made out of red lentils, red lentil flour, white rice, and pea protein. The white rice is interesting. The white rice is interesting. The white rice. The white rice is interesting. <laughs> what the f We're gonna make this and I'm gonna show you my sauce recipe as well. What do you want? For this, you will need. Broccoli, but also a bell pepper. Lily thinks this is not a side dish, but I think a bell pepper is a side dish. And if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I love bell peppers so much that I will just eat them raw. Pot, pan, heat, you get the drill. I think I eat at about half a box. It's kind of a lot, but whatever. I measure by how full the bowl is. Half bowl is usually what I like to go with. Not half empty. And that's ready to go in the hot water when it's boiled. Cutting board, another pan for the sauce. One spoon. No! I'm gonna go put this in the wash bag. I used about half a bottle of the sauce, which would be 250 milliliters. Pasta is officially in. Pasta sauce. We're gonna add some more ingredients. Now for the fun part, broccoli. This much broccoli. I'm gonna cut all of the stems off and then just break it apart. Not too small, but small enough to eat. I'm literally like your crazy aunt that comes to town and is like telling you you should eat more vegetables. Then this bee proceeded to eat an entire bell pepper. I have about 10 bell peppers in my fridge at all times. Yesterday I cut up a cantaloupe, so I imagine I'll probably have that for dessert. Mm -hmm. All right, it's all done. Look at how delicious, oh my God. It's just really hot right now. This is probably like my fourth of these waters. I'm gonna fill it up right now. I don't know how this combination literally tastes like straight up mac and cheese. My anxiety gets worse the more I see the camera battery flash. A few hours later, she went for the cantaloupe. 